Hi. I can't see you. I don't know. Just say hi. Oh. Hey, hey, guys. <laughs> okay, let's, um, yeah. let's see. Uh, what does Project Pain mean to you? Project Pain? <laughs> it's pretty discreet. <laughs> I don't know. It's just, it's a way, like, to let people know, like, from the stuff that we've learned and the way that we've learned how to cope with it, at least. And stuff that we've learned from what we've gone through and to let people know so they don't have to go through to learn it. So what uh, they, they are going through or they will go through it, they can or have already gone through, it's easier. So they can get closure. They can just be, feel better. Um, what's one of the main reasons why you want to help you know, me to help Project Pain. I want to help you to help Project Pain. Like, like, what's yeah. what what what, uh, what draws you to this? Just, just that it's helping, and I know like you need as much help as you can, and it's hard to realize. Not that you need the help. I mean, that is hard to realize too. But it's hard to realize that you can get the help, because that's one of the hardest things for you to. No, at any time, but during the hardest times, during depression, during times that you're struggling to stay afloat, like, I know that, and we're, just, we're here to tell you that you can't, you get it from your friends, your loved ones, even strangers, and it's just to help people, that's why, and because I knew, I know, like, I, it helped me a lot, this sort of stuff. Oh, they sold me a lot, but I had stuff. Um, what sort of experience do you bring to the table on helping people? Well, I know how to push it through. <laughs> uh, I'm just, well, I've got to do a lot, but I learned a lot of stuff from it, more or less. Just, and it's, I don't know, it's a kind of knowing like you know, you know? Yeah. That's almost a religion. But not... But it's something you know is true. I, I don't know, like, I want to tell people just from what I saw happening. It's me and tell this. It's a lot of dead silence, what I think. <laughs> um... <laughs> <laughs> right, we'll just throw elevator music in there somewhere. <laughs> or like the Bassett dubstep track. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> yeah, um, let's see. Um, is that a mango? It's definitely a mango. Alright, we just brought a mango into this. This mango is the new Project Pain number. We should like carve Project Pain into the mango. We should. I want to now. <laughs> We need a butter knife. We'll do it later. Um, <laughs> is it Sir Mango? Doctor? Oh, crap. Doctor um, Sir Mango? Yeah, it's Doctor Sir Mango. The third. Doctor Doctor. <laughs> um, Got a bad if, case. Oh, no, wait. Um, what? If you couldn't breathe without going into detail, oh yeah, and that's a parrot. Um, <laughs> if you could, if you could go into detail, like like without okay, without going into detail, like just the basic overview, like Spark notes it. <laughs> um, what, like? I can annotate too. That works. Um, <laughs> like, like what? Like, I know we've all been hurt, and like most of us that are helping, are doing this because you know, we went through shit and we hated it, and we had no one there to help us. Um, like, spark note abridged version. <laughs> <laughs> the best uh, part. <laughs> like, what happened to you, and why are you passionate about this project? Well, so. <laughs> well, basically it was more or less a form of neglect, sort of, kind of, sort of, basically. But um, I've had depression for three years straight, and so that's why I don't remember middle school. Uh, not drugs, not alcohol, but depression. Uh, three years, but I don't know, I made it out of that completely, and I'm good now. And people helped a lot, shit, and it was 
it was a form of, it was neglect and three years of depression and divorce for first year so and that's Spartans <laughs> that's it nah my phone died <laughs> you didn't hear that <laughs> This is gonna be a weird video. Oh, um, <laughs> parrots, some mangoes, and bones. Yeah, um, and, and a basset hound. If we can get her in the shot, the basset hound. Sure. She no, she, she, we're not getting her in the shot. Come on, no, are we? Mango. No, no, a mango. No, pass mango. Yeah. <laughs> Director with a mango. <laughs> Director mango. I have the power. <laughs> you have the power. Um, Director. Let's see. Uh, is there anything like that? Like anything at all? There really are pressure on people to help. Like I know that even if it seems, is people have the release a sense of decency, a sense of goodness in them. And every, everyone wants to help. Everyone is willing to. It's just there's certain things that sometimes prevent them from doing it, from being able to, from even being, realizing that it's a necessity. Necessity. You really do just have to ask, and you, even if you don't know how to ask, just ask. Because it's better than not. And they'll understand that, they even if it's a stranger. As long as you know, they won't rape and burn you. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> don't accept the candy, but accept the advice. <laughs> but what if it's like high quality candy? Then you give it to me. <laughs> and I get it. But you really do just have to ask your friends, your family, your loved ones will be there for you. It's a little project pain. Yeah, and if, if not, they're not, you know, we are. Yeah. And, and our Basset Hound. And our Basset Hound. And Sir Director, Dr. Bingo the third. The but Bingo. Seriously, though, everyone, absolutely everyone wants to help. They just, they're just sometimes things that prevent it from its not realizing, not knowing that it's this needed or not knowing how to express it, or knowing that, like, it's the right thing to do, you know? Just go, if you don't find one person, find, look, everywhere, you know? Friends, loved ones, strangers, doesn't matter who, Project Pain is made specifically for this purpose, too. So, go, go to everyone. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I feel like behind you there's a horse. <laughs> I just realized that. It's majestic. <laughs> it is very majestic. Let's see if we can zoom in on that horse real fast. Uh, yeah, that's a pretty horse. It's a, a gorgeous horse. Yeah, okay, we're done here.